Hey folks, this is Dennis from Make Easy, and I hope everyone is at home, staying safe and doing well under these strange circumstances. Uh, so one thing you might be noticing in your household is that everyone is online all at the same time, which is probably slowing down your internet access. So here's an easy way that many people don't know about to make your home Wi-Fi internet faster. This is Make Easy, how to make your home Wi-Fi internet faster. In order to change the channel of your router, you're gonna need two things. The first thing you're gonna need is your IP address and the login information for your router so that you can go in and change the channels. Uh, whoever set up the router in your household will have this information. And the second thing you're gonna need is a Wi-Fi analyzer type app. I'm using the one for Windows 10, which can be found on the Microsoft Store, literally called Wi-Fi Analyzer. And I've put links down below uh, for an iOS and Android app. So you're gonna need this so that you can see all the channels that all the different networks are on. So I'll let you go grab those things first and then we'll continue on with how to make your internet faster. Okay, now that you have your Wi-Fi analyzer set up, let's take a look at all the networks your Wi-Fi is picking up. So in North America, by default, the routers you buy uh, come preset to channels one, six, and 11. So if all the different networks are on one of those three channels, there could be some interference and in turn, it'll slow your internet down. So when we look down below, it's no surprise that we see 14 different networks on channel one. We see 12 different networks on channel six. I'm on uh, channel six, I'm ZFG right here. And I purposely put it on a channel that's a little busier so that we can compare internet speeds. And on channel 11, we have 12 different networks. So what we're gonna wanna try to do is change our channel so that we're on an empty or emptier channel. Okay, the default channels for 1, 6, and 11 are for the 2.4 gigahertz spectrum. So when you go to the 5 gigahertz spectrum, the numbering of the channels is a little bit different. Uh, they range from 149 to 161. So I am currently on channel 157. We can see that there's six different networks on it. Again, I purposely chose a busier channel so that we can compare internet speeds. Okay, now that we know that Wi-Fi's can interfere with each other if there's too many on the same channel, before I change the channel to an emptier one, I'm gonna do a quick internet speed test. Okay, using Google speed internet test, let's see how fast my network is. Okay, and it looks like I'm hitting at about 112, 113 megabytes per second download. Okay, let's go ahead into your Wi-Fi settings to change the channel of your router. So as I mentioned before, whoever set up the router in your household will have this information. So once you log in, you want to go into your router's menu and you want to find this heading, wireless. And once you click wireless, you will get this menu. Okay, now that you're in your router settings, scroll down to the wireless section and find the area where you can change the channel of the different spectrums. So in the 2.4 gigahertz spectrum, I am on channel six and that's what my Wi-Fi analyzer says. And as you can see, channels one, six, and 11 are the busiest. So you wanna to try to change your channel to an empty one. So I see right now that two, eight, nine, 10, and 12 are open or free. So I'm gonna just choose 10. Okay. Now that we've changed the channel for the 2.4 gigahertz spectrum, let's change the channel for the 5G spectrum. So we'll switch over to the 5G tab. As you can see right now, I'm on channel 157. Switching over to the five gigahertz band, we see that on channel 157, there are four networks on it. So 
I want to try to change it to an empty one, maybe 161 or channel 44. So in here, it's going to switch it to... Okay, it looks like I don't have the option for 161, so I'm going to switch it to a 44. Okay, once you selected the channels you want, you should save the changes and restart your computer so that the channels can take into effect. And then we'll do one more thing. We'll test my internet connection speed and we'll see if that made any difference. Okay, welcome back. Now that you've restarted your computer, let's take a look to see if the changes did go into effect. So if you recall, I changed my 2.4 gigahertz band from six to 10, channel six to 10, and I'm the only one on this channel. Uh, switching to the 5G tab, I went from 157, channel 157, which there was five routers on it, six routers now, and I changed it to 44, which has less. So the last thing we gotta do is let's do an internet speed test and let's see if this made any difference at all. Okay, so as you can see, I'm now hitting at roughly 198, 200, uh, roughly almost double uh, than what I was getting before. So I would like to know how you guys, how your results are. Um, please share, please let me know if you found by changing your router's channel whether you received faster internet service. I hope you like the make easy tip. Let me know in the comments section down below if this tip helped you, work for you, and if so, how much faster your Wi-Fi is now. Thanks guys for watching. If you're looking for more practical tips, please subscribe to our channel. Stay safe everyone, and until next time, get great.